Hello and welcome to my channel, Scott and Mushroom Foraging and Fishing. Uh, I want to introduce you to a new type of mushroom. It's called the stinkhorn. I just had a smell in the air. Sometimes, from if the right the wind direction is there, you can smell it from quite a distance away. And I just could get that rift in my nose, and I found them. But before I found the one who was actually stinking, I found a young one. It just looks like an egg case. It's got like a slimy surface, so it's just about to break out. Stinkhorn is an edible mushroom in that form. You could slice it and then just fry it and eat it like that. I never tried it and I'm not planning to. It's a medicinal, it's supposed to have some healthy properties, so I haven't done any research into it. So, uh, okay, let's go and see the other one. You might see it in the distance there. There's one. Oh, it's quite a big one. And basically with the smell, it it, it, it has for the first 24 hours like a, a like a netted skirt around it and it uh, secretes a chemical which stinks and that attracts the flies and poor it really reeks and yeah the flies then will take the spores away and and we spores it somewhere else yeah so you still can see the case in there where it's broken out. Yeah, nice find. That's quite a big one. I think I saw another one. Yeah. So that's why hence the the strong smell. There's another one here. Yeah, so you can see the case where the, where it came out from. There you go. Yeah. So as I said in the young stage, uh, it's the first one I showed to you, it's edible. But I never tried it and I'm not going to. Yeah, we just be back here in Blair Adams Forest and I'm just looking at some other, uh, want to find some other ones. But as I said, I just got a woof in my nose and I just followed the smell. So, yeah, if the wind is in the right direction, you can follow the smell and you could find them. Great find, good start. I'm not going to take it home and, 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 and explain it in more detail. <laughs> it's going to stink the whole house out. So, yeah, okay, join me and we carry on searching. Right, what have we here? Greenish color, I can see slightly uh, mainly green. Yes, mainly green. Let's test the gill. I mean, it's definitely a rustler, a brittle gill. Let's take the, yeah, they're quite soft. The, yeah, that's a charcoal burner. Nice find. Yeah, that's definitely charcoal burner. And I've seen something else here. There's a little one, something little here. This. I don't know, it could be a very, very young blusher. Let's leave it here. Oh, yeah, here. There is a very young blusher. Yeah. Well, it's not young, it's already old, but it's small. <laughs> small. There you go. Of course, we leave it here. It's already full of maggots. Full of maggots. Uh, yeah, that's a blusher. So that probably is a very young blusher as well. So yeah, we're definitely going to take this bad boy. Okay. Well, I'm going to cut and see if it's actually let's close the hole. Uh, Oh, there's another one here. Oh yeah, that's that's another one here. 
There you go. It looks like another charcoal burner. Yeah, I got it. Well, now I'm just going to grab my knife. Now, unfortunately, you already can see though, the maggots are already in here. So, I'm going to leave it here. Same as this one. I already can see the holes. Yeah, there's already holes in it, so leave it here. Shame, but that's the way it goes. Because it's so wet, so wet that the maggots are in there straight away. So, okay, let's see if we find something else. So, that's a good start. So, in the last video, I introduced you to the blusher. So, not to confuse with the panther cap. Uh, okay, let's have a look around here. See if we can find something else here. What's this here? Oh yeah, there's something else here. Yeah, it looks like another, I believe, blusher. So they're strong in the coming now. So, yeah, I'll keep you posted when I find something else. We need to find something else here. Well, let me get one of them out. So, they're all brownish. I think I've seen in one of my other videos. I don't know what they are. Yeah, if you know, please leave it in the comments. They're all just like brown. Yeah, they don't exclude any milk, so they're not one of the milk caps. If you know, please let me know. Right, I found one here. Actually, it's a milk cap. It's got white milk, and so I couldn't, I can't really identify a pattern on the top. So, if you know what it is. I mean, with the milk cap, you, you can try the milk. Make sure you spit it out. It's mild tasting, so it might be an edible one. So, yeah, nice to see. I don't know which milk cap it is. If you know, please leave it in a comment. Right, nice to see. It smells mushroomy. So, yeah. Another one on the list. Let's see what else we can find. Yeah, so mushrooms are on the coming now. Ah, oh, there's another one. Yeah, there's another one. Tiny weeny one. I don't know if that is a milk cap or not. It's very young. Yeah, if you rub along the gills, and then you can see if it's a milk cap or not. I can't see any milk coming, so. There's some more down here. Yeah, so I'm really after so like edible ones. Like the saffron milk cap, the full saffron milk cap. Uh, which are so like more autumn mushrooms. Oh yeah, there's, there's loads more here. Loads more here. So, there you go. <coughs> so I don't really know what they are. Because there's so many milk caps around. I'm after the tasting good edible ones. Okay, I'll update you when you find some more. Here we have another stink horn. Oh yeah, that's very wet. Yeah, nice and stinky. Yeah, there's the bulb on the bottom, slimy bulb. 
Oh, that really reeks. Ooh, let's get out of here. So, I finished my round and I didn't find any other mushrooms or different species. So, yeah. I hope you found it interesting and we definitely will see you next time on our, one of my next videos and well I'm, I'm trying to get to go for a fishing session tomorrow at Petticure again for flatfish so hopefully I can upload a video and show you some fish until then I'll see you later bye bye